Hello everybody to Philip Jennings neighborhood in Thailand. It's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. A wonderful day in the neighborhood. I know you don't want to be my neighbor. Well, thanks to Chris Wren, the fake one, the troll Chris Wren, the fake Brit the Philippines. He's putting comments below my video that I'm trying to tell you people how to live in Thailand. I'm not trying to tell you how to live. I'm just showing you what I'm doing. You know, you can do what you want. I mean, but a coffee shop and a laundry mat is not a bad place to hang out at, especially since I'm a coffee shop kind of guy. You know, I mean, what better place to hang out, man? Nice, safe place. Yeah. Late at night, you get a security guard sitting right down on the steps. Helps wave traffic out into the streets, you know? Got a good paying job, hard work at time. Look, you got women that come here to do their laundry, man. Oh, I found out that condo across the way there, like condos like that in this area. If you were to rent those by the month, on a long stay, I mean, you'd have to rent it for at least six months, you know, like at least. You get it for about 8,000 baht, but then you'd have to pay probably seven or eight Thai baht per unit, depending on the building for the electricity. And you'd probably have to pay the water too. So where I'm at, you know, they come and take clean the sheets every day and bring you bottles of water and bring you coffee. And do everything except give you a hand job, you know. Oh, here's my buddy now showing up in his chair. Security guy. Yep, we're at the coffee shop. I know you're saying, what? No Dunkin' Donuts? No railroad trains? Damn. That's back in the USA. We're in Thailand now. Huh? But yeah, you know, he said I'm living on a low budget. I'm guessing, uh, am I? Yes, I am. That's what made me want to come out and spend 60 whole baht. 60 whole baht, that's like a dollar twenty-five for an iced latte. When I could have just stayed in tonight, I got a bunch of snacks and I got you know cable TV and I got good Wi-Fi and I could watch all the drunken idiots on YouTube, but I said, you know what, I'll just come out here. I see that the Philippines is getting hit by God's wrath again, you know. Another typhoon. Why would he be inflicting his wrath on such a Christian population? You know? Well, if you believe in things like that, you know. And that's what the coffee shop looks like on the inside there. You got my uh, barista behind the counter. I gave her a 10 buck tip because, you know, they got to grind the coffee first and then, you know, fix it all up correctly and put the right amount of milk in there and then throw ice in the cup and all that good stuff. I noticed like every other tie on a motorbike, you got a guitar, man. They're kind of guitar with them. I mean, there's only a few clubs I've seen that they have live music, so I wonder what they're up to with all these guitars. Are they trying to be like the, the new thing instead of K-pop? It's going to be Thai pop or what, you know? They all have like little garage bands or what's going on, you know? But, you know, nice view here from a uh, coffee shop, you know? You got the ladies walking by, you know, come to the laundromat to do their clothes. You know they're clean because they're washing their clothes, right? That little resta over there, she's got some good uh, fried clams uh, with noodles. Dish. Yeah, just check it in. I'm telling you all to thank the fake Chris Red. I put out another video. Because I wasn't going to spend any money today because I'm on such a low budget, you know. Like I'll show you what I'm really doing here, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, I only show you guys what I want you to see, you know. But, uh, yeah, Thailand's a great place. As far as uh, Philippines being number one for retirement, I would say no. For tourism, yes. But Vietnam and Thailand... Way, way, way beats them out for retirement. Much cheaper. Live a way better life. Better infrastructure. Yeah, less crime. Don't have to worry about being pickpocketed and shit.
got a little guard dog there. He runs back and forth. Little, little, little dog with his vest for the doggy people. All right. So yeah, we even got a little bendy straw, man. They give you a little bendy straw with your drink here, man. Jeez. You guys in the Philippines, good luck with the typhoon. Hope y'all stay safe. Ain't got a lot. Everybody out there have a great weekend. It's Sunday here, so I guess it's Saturday there. Have a great weekend. I wish you could be with me just chilling at the coffee shop. What? No Dunkin' Donuts? Adios, amigos.